Here are 220 pounds in the final. We have Jordan Wood, record of 41 and one on the season. He's a senior from Boyertown, and Cade Lamar, a junior from Conestoga, the record of 24 and three. And right away, Jordan Wood in on the shot. He switched off to a double, and he gets a takedown. Ten seconds in the match here. We'll see if it'll be another quick pin like in the final of the Pac-10s last pounds. week. He's going two on one, looking to go maybe a little hazard tilt. Going for fifth place. Now it looks like he's gonna come over top to get that cross face cradle Cassidy. rocked up. Lamar comes in with a lifetime record of 34 and 20. He beat Connor Mitchell in the semifinal to make his way here. Jordan Wood comes in with a lifetime record of 148 and five. He made the decision Mike Modungo from Upper Perk in the semifinal. We have injury time here by Jordan Wood. He looks like he's in a lot of pain, holding his ribs. A lot of pain on his face right now. Maybe took a shot to the ribs. They're looking at him, feeling to see if it was possible. Like he's feeling kind of fractured or something. Oh, Wood cuts time and he's going to get back after it here. See if Wood attempts to. He puts, him, puts Wood, Lamar up on their feet. Comes in, he's digging in, he's got the over-under going right now. See if he tries to launch him. Matt locks over top. Lamar, he looks the back hook. And Lamar looks to get on top, but doesn't get it, quite get it. Now, nice arm pass into a single. Wood tried for his trademark crotch lift to his back. For a second there, Jim got real quiet as Wood went to his hip, almost to his back. So Lamar tried to get away, and Wood just... Clamped down on his ankle, sucked him back in there. He was having no part of that. <laughs> He's got that farm boy strength. There's big Dutchman over there in Boyertown. Doesn't hurt his dad owns a gym either. No, that kind of helps a little bit. They're working on near side one on one and far ankle. So he's trying to do here with 40 seconds to go in the first period. Now he's got half, half and tight waist. And he's starting to run that. Now he's on half wrist. Still going. Lamar peels that off. Now he's back to that cross face cradle. Tell you what, Lamar is Lamar. Lamar kid strong, and there's Wood again. Something's not right with Jordan Wood here. It's gonna be Lamar's choice here when they come back in. Be interesting where he goes. If he's going to continue here, just needs to be smart. You know, no he's need got to be 24 seconds of injury time left. I would say to be smart, he does not go back to that cross face cradle. Yeah, right, the second time that he attempted to do that, but extreme pain in his rib cage. Got his choice there, he picked down. Still 15 seconds here left in the first period. 4-2 lead for Jordan Wood. And just seeing on his face, it's 4-3 here as the period's winding down. Something is just not right with that. Right side, a lot of pain in his face right now. Having trouble breathing a little bit, it looks like. He's holding it right now. The problem is going to be he's not a kid that can gear back. He's a, he, he's not going to go slow down. 
There's his padded yeah. crotch lift. He's got to get a pin right here and get off the mat. Yep, yeah, he's got Lamar in trouble right now. He's going to look to fish that other arm. He's at the near side shoulder trapped. You can tell he's now struggling. He's, he's holding two back. Now he's got him in trouble. He's got to get off that leg free. Come on, Lamar. Lamar kid's tough. You can Strong. tell Wood is fighting. Wood's in, Wood is in not tears. feeling it. You can see it in his face. We'll see if Lamar can take advantage of it. Maybe try a lift and try to bear hug and put pressure on it. <laughs> Minute 16 left in the second period here, and it's a 6-4 match. A lot of, like you said, Wood just not himself. Wood now with the underhook. This kid's a rare breed, man. It's fun to watch him wrestle. He moves so well for a big guy, and he's so very physical like that. I think he just, what he's doing right now is smart. Just try and get risk control. Twenty-two seconds to go here in the second period. I think Wood is, you know, like you said, maybe content to just bruise here. Not in his nature, gearing back, but it's about preservation and maybe not making what might be an injury even worse. Lamar's got to get super aggressive here, put the pressure on. Yeah, I think you're right, Chuck. He has an opportunity here. Obviously, Wood's not at 100%. We really push the page. You never know what could happen here. I mean, we won't know either if the ref doesn't get out of the way of the camera, but. <laughs> I think the problem for Lamar right now is that Wood's hand fighting ability is gonna gonna thwart anything he attempts. Let's see if he uses, let's see if Wood uses that underhook. He's looking for a foot sweep attempt. He's not letting Lamar get into the mat. You know, he's he's, he's pinning him on the, on the edge of the mat there. Lamar can't tie up. He's got to take a shot from outside. Maybe get him off balance. Now go. See, you lost an opportunity right there. You're right, Chuck. He's got to create some movement. And test what he's obviously got pain in his ribs. Create some movement and see what he can do here. 45 seconds to go in the period. Match for that matter. Wood living in that underhook right there. Great job tying him with that underhook as we wind under 10 seconds to go in the match. And content to get away out of here with a 6-4 win. Tremendous fight in Wood. Good effort there by Lamar. Good luck to both of these gentlemen next week at regionals.